Let's go. Let's go back a little further. How how did you how did you start? Like what what made you say, hey, I'm gonna go into desserts? I mean, that's not that's not something that I heard all the time. If somebody wanted to start a business. Like why desserts? How far back? Like I mean, I went this. I mean, up until so like high school. When did it start? Yeah, what ingrained it? What what something must have ingrained the, your curiosity? Little, the little, what's the little your thing? passion. Like, uh, not the, the little one with the strings. Like, no, the harp. Harp, like the harp. <laughs> Memories. Not, yeah, what, what was your first, I like guess? Wayne's World. I started selling cupcakes in high school. Like, I no went to school. Yeah, like maybe you never got one because they sold out cheated. fast. I never got <laughs> no, yeah, like they sold out fast. I would just bring um, just cupcakes, usually like 24 cupcakes. Really? What in kind a of freaking Dos Equis box that my mom would get from the grocery store. <laughs> Like she would, you know, like the box they put the beer in, it was the perfect size for the cupcakes to fit in there flat. And I just bring that. I'm sure somebody's going to try that. <laughs> yeah, just ask them. They give you the box at the grocery store, no problem, they're free. So like, yeah, I'd go there and sell them for 50 cents. I mean, I probably should have charged more. But yeah, that's that was really where I got my start in baking and selling things. And then people would just be throwing their money at me. And you know, like, I mean, it was like that. It's like, how many do you want? You know, like, they're like, you're auctioning stuff off. Okay, two, hi, what about you? Two, three, all right. Um, but yeah, that's really like the first start of it was just kind of like for Was fun. that freshman year, sophomore year, what? I think I want to say it was sophomore year. Sophomore year, okay. Yeah, but then I get in trouble because you're not supposed to do that because you're supposed to go to the school. Like the money's supposed to go to the school or something. I don't know. When you're selling you can't in school, yeah, it's, it's like it's what? considered I'm sorry. Yeah. You're not supposed to do that in the school. You, did you keep on doing it? It's okay. She had just a just under, just a few more time. She had an underground market of uh, cupcakes, yes. illegal cupcakes. I mean, I had to start giving them away to teachers and stuff, so I wouldn't get in trouble. But okay. Uh, um, but no, so pay for a few things. Them pretty much. <laughs> All right, but everyone likes cupcakes. Yeah, come on, now. <laughs> So then after that, so... Okay, yes, I'm not going to go through all the details, but so... No, we want to... No, well, <laughs> we're talking about baking. So, like, I didn't... I got into culinary school at 21. Yeah, and I, I thought I was going to go into another field completely different than that. But um, I went to culinary school and kind of did it, like, legit, because I was working at Kroger at the time. Before that? Before that, yeah. And I was like, I want to do this, like, for real. You know, okay. like, like try to find out how do you do stuff from scratch, because, right. you know, I'm not going to lie, the cupcakes in high school were from a box, so I, that's the only thing I knew how to do. All I knew was that and stuff at grocery stores and, like, stuff at Mexican bakeries. Mm -hmm. And that's all good, but I didn't know. I knew there was, like, a bigger world of desserts out there. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so um, the school just, like, opened my eyes to French pastry, which is, like, pretty much by far, like, the most amazing pastry still to this day, I think, because it's not very sweet and it's, it's just rich on flavors and yes. stuff like that.